Advanced Controls for PDF Layout Create beautiful PDF output, complete with tables of contents, glossary, and index. With a name like RoboHelp, it's not surprising that an application designed for topic-based output and for creating online help systems and knowledge bases creates gorgeous output for the web. And right along with that great web and mobile output, RoboHelp can produce great custom full-featured PDF output from your help topics, complete with tables of contents, glossary, and index. Customizing your PDF layout starts on the author pane in the table of contents. RoboHelp allows you to specify either an online TOC or a book TOC. When we go to an online TOC, you'll see options like Insert Child Project, which would be specific to online output. Likewise, when we go to a book TOC, we have options for inserting front matter and back matter. In my book or my print TOC, I've already added options for the TOC page and index, glossary, and back cover. We'll need this book TOC as we go forward and look at our templates and our output presets. Over in the output pane, in the templates section, you have the ability to create templates for many different things, including PDF and Word. I've already created a PDF template, named it Book Template, and you can see that it has a number of different resources, all that can be customized by me here in RoboHelp. For example, inside of Chapter First, I can display all the properties that will be used within my PDF output. Notice I have separate templates for every part of the book that I might want to put into my PDF, including the glossary and the index. Moving over to Output Presets. RoboHelp lets me set up nearly a dozen publishing intents, including, near the bottom, PDF and Word. Again, I've already set up my PDF template. And moving over there, I'm going to make sure that I go to the General tab and set an output path and a PDF name. And then to Layout, to ensure that I have the template that I set up earlier identified for my layout. I'll go ahead and generate that preset. And then click on View Output. Here I've got my PDF, complete with a table of contents, my content, and in my back matter, both my index and glossary. This gives you one more way to extend the reach of your content by providing PDF to your audiences when and where they need it. For a personalized demo or questions, please write to us, techcom at adobe.com.